Today we are going to test the TD-OS5 by Top Greener and measure how much electricity it is using. We're going to use the Fluke 87 multimeter and the kilowatt PS10 to make these measurements. So you can see this is the TD-OS5 and uh, our control will be the uh, Sylvania 8 watt LED light bulb. Okay, first I'm going to hook up the control bulb and measure the milliamps with the fluke and then measure the wattage and power factor with the kilowatt power strip. And our control currently measures at 66.7 milliamps on the fluke and it shows uh, 7.5, 7.6 watts at about 90% power factor. Now we're going to turn the power off and connect the TDOS5. Here's the uh, TDOS 5. Okay, we're all connected up. Okay, we're ready to power on. And I'm gonna turn off the light at first. Okay, at idle, the TDOS is measuring 35, about 35 milliamps. And now let's look at the kilowatts. The kilowatt currently reads about 0 0.9 to 1 watt, even 0.8 watts. And uh, power factor is at 19%. Uh, that means it's using only about uh, 0.8 watts at 20% uh, of its capacity. Let's turn the LED on and check the fluke and the kilowatts again. Okay, the, um, the fluke shows 88.8 .8 milliamps and the kilowatt shows 8.5 watts and 77% power factor. Now let's put, put all the numbers together and calculate the amount of energy being used. Let's uh, start first with a formula that will give us wattage when measuring AC and that formula is watts equals amps times volts times power factor okay uh, we're going to start with the uh, the amps we're reading 35 milliamps and we're going to convert it by multiplying the uh, milliamps and if we multiply 35 milliamps times 0 0.001 that'll give us 0 0.035 amps so we're going to multiply 0 0.035 amps 
times 120 volts times, let's say, 20% power factor. Okay, and when we do the math, 0 0.035 times 120 times 20%, which is 0 0.20. That should give us 0.84 watts. 0.84 watts. Okay, and to calculate the cost of keeping the sensor on idle, you multiply 0.84 watts times 24 hours, times 365 days, and that will be 1,000,000. And what we got is uh, 7,358.4, and to convert that to uh, kilowatt hours, you multiply that by also a thousand, and that will give us 7.35 kilowatt, 7.35 kilowatt hours, and that's per year. Okay, and when you multiply uh, the national average of uh, 12 cents per kilowatt hours, that will give us 88 cents per year to, uh, to keep the TDOS 5 on idle. And that's 24 hours a day and 365 days a year. And that would conclude our test here today.